Hello, in this lecture we're going to define purchase discount. According to Fundamental Accounting Principles, Wild 22nd Edition, the definition of purchase discount is term used by a purchaser to describe a cash discount granted to the purchaser for paying within the discount period. So we are talking about a discount. When we talk about discounts, question is often, are we receiving the discount? Are we giving the discount? Are we the purchaser or are we the seller? This discount uh, definition in is in terms of the perspective of the purchaser, a uh, term used by the purchaser to describe the cash discount granted to the purchaser. So in this perspective, we are the purchaser. We're receiving a cash discount, possibly from buying something like inventory from the uh, seller, from the vendor. Let's take a look at a transaction. We are the owner over here on the left-hand side. We have the vendor on the right-hand side. We are purchasing inventory, 6,500 worth of it on account, meaning we are giving for that inventory an IOU. We're gonna pay within the future. Terms may look something like this, two slash 10 in slash 30, meaning we get a 2% discount if we pay within 10 days, otherwise we pay within 30 days. This 6,500 is the sticker price when we first record the transaction, typically we're going to put it on at the entire full price, 6500 then deal with this discount if we pay within the discounted period of, in this case, 10 days. Therefore, a journal entry would do something like this, increase inventory by 6500 and increase the accounts payable by that same 6500 the amount before the 2% discount, as if we paid within 30 days, not necessarily within 10 days, then the transaction would look something like this. This would be just the recording of this transaction, 6,500 increasing the inventory and increasing the accounts payable. If we then paid within the discounted time period, we would then have the purchase discount that would be granted from the vendor to us, the owner, to the purchaser in this case, and we would have the 6,500 would be reduced, meaning we would reduce the amount of the IOU because we're gonna get that 2% discount because we paid within the discount period of 10 days. That means we're also gonna reduce the amount of cash that we're gonna have to pay. We had the IOU on the books at 6,500, we're gonna to have to actually reduce that IOU, which will reduce the amount that is eventually paid. Confusing thing about this transaction for most students is that the other side of the transaction is we're gonna to have to reduce the inventory. We put the inventory on the books at 6,500. However, we didn't actually pay 6,500 for it. Now we gotta say uh, that we're gonna pay 2% less of that, reduce the inventory that is on our books. Therefore, journal entry, reducing accounts payable would reduce the inventory basically reducing the amount of cash that uh, we're gonna have to pay, of course, at the time that we pay, if we're paying within that discounted time period.